What's happening? Crypto fam, happy, happy Tuesday. Is it, is it New Year's Eve? It's New Year's, New Year's Eve. Happy, happy New Year's Eve. Ha <laughs> ha. Good morning. And welcome back to Love for Crypto. I'm Scott and it is a pleasure to have you here. I appreciate you taking the time out to consume the content and I've just nearly knocked my brew over, but it's all right. <laughs> I'm, in an, I'm in an half decent mood today. Need to get back in work for next week though, because it's fucking shy. The pennies are running out. The pennies are running out. We've saved money to get over the holidays now. We've saved money to get through the holidays. Christmas, Hanukkah, holiday, whatever the fuck you was planning. Happy New Year, fucking celebrations. The money's running low, man, and I need to get back in work next week. But you all know I'm sick of manual labor. So we need to figure out a way to make our money work for us. Like Warren Buffett says, make money while you're asleep. Wizard crew, yeah? We're all trying to get on it and make a little bit of money, whether it's trading, whether it's investing, whatever. So, just a few little highlights and tips. 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 Go and look yourself. Make your own decisions. I'm not telling you what to do with your own money and value. I'm just highlighting there's a few things you can do. One, save money. Not too long till you spend it anyway. You ain't getting rich saving fucking money unless you're earning a wage that's gonna make you rich anyway. Investing, what we're all doing, whether that's crypto, whether it's stocks and shares, just invest, even investing in yourself. Buy yourself a laptop PC, start a YouTube or a cinnamon channel. Do whatever you want to do. Start a flaming fulfilled by Amazon shop on Facebook. Whatever you want to do. Invest in not only other stuff but yourself as well. Beyond investment, trading, day trading, you're not really investing, you're day, you're day trading. To invest, you're going to invest and leave it and you're going to be happy about your investment, right? So for all the people that are moaning, daily about the price oh it's up and down it's up and fucking down all the time it's up and fucking down all the time well long and short it then dickhead long and short it mate mm. and fucking go and trade it you shut the fuck up moaning Mo <laughs> do something just do something it's as easy as that. Oh, but Scott, but Scott, what could I do, mate? What could I do? Well, you can move a little bit off your ledger to bit true and get it in the power pigger, yeah? So the power pigger, for instance, just one thing that you could be doing on the side, you're getting US dollar tether locked up for 30 days can bring you 13% back. XRP a lot for 30 days, 10% back. BTR, 15% back. NXP, MPXS, 5% back. Bitcoin, 10% back. One coins, 5% back. Ethereum, 10%. Cardano, 5%. TRX, 5.3%. Uh, sorry. Hot coins, 5.3%. You can lock VET up over unlimited time scale for 7.3% now. Understand it's um, sometimes not easy for everyone to get into this, but you got to be trying. If you're moaning, if you're moaning that your investment's taking too long to come off, you've got to do something else to make some funds to increase your value, increase your net worth, right? We've got Power Pigger. Invest in yourself. Invest in stocks and shares. And then there's trading. We can get on bit for next Hugo's way, anything like that, and do it for anything from times free leverage to times flaming 200, mate. You catch that on the right candle. Yeah? <sighs> mate, talk to me about gains and you're leveraging times 200. But basically, we've started trading. Now, my trading account. What, like 250 300 dollars I think I put in it. Worth a Bitcoin. I think it was 270 eh? There's a bit of Bitcoin and a bit of XRP, so... 
my account the other day, right? I ended up in three percent getting greedy, and I'm looking for five to ten percent. And I'm in at a three percent gain. Cheers, wizard. Thanks, Tory, for your call, mate. Jumped on it, got in it, had a look at it. I liked it. I was in three percent, man. I was seeing four and five dollars. Four dollars on XRP. Five dollar gains on BTC and Billy Big Balls here thinking, oh, wait for the ten percent like a fucking knob. Wait for the ten percent. Being greedy, being greedy. When what I should have been doing was thinking to myself, right, Scott, there's five dollars there on a two hundred and seventy dollar account. There's ten dollars if you add both trades up. Ten dollars on a two hundred and seventy dollar account. I should have took it. I should have just took it. $280 account then, isn't it? Yeah? And then when it's $2,700 account, that was 30, uh, that was 40 and $50. Put together nearly $90, nearly $100. Yeah? And it went up to three grand account on one trade. If that was a $27,000 account, it was fucking four hundred and five hundred dollars nearly a thousand dollars on one trade not one like that that was a fucking lie mate <laughs> lying for what i thought it was from friday to fucking sunday but you know what i'm getting at people are getting in and they're getting too impatient and you're chasing the massive gains where if you just sit back and think to yourself say hang on a minute this 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 account's worth next to nothing and it's pulled me five dollars now imagine it was worth 10 grand. It'd have pulled me 50. It'd have pulled me 500. And you've got to think like that. So all them little five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollars over the next six months is gonna take, is gonna elevate your account, yeah, into the next stage of your trading, where then one, two, three, four, five percent are pipping off a lot more than four and five dollars. It's about patience. Not only do you need patience with your investments, you need patience with yourself, your decisions, how you're executing your dreams. You're gonna have to have patience with your trading. You'll have to have patience with a 30 days of power pigger. Do you know what I mean? But you've got to do something if you're moaning. It's only if, if, if you're not moaning, fucking sat, wait, sat back with a brewski like that. We're all good, bruh. We're all good. But if you're moaning, Oh, I'm fucking sick of the prices up and down. I'm fucking sick that it's still under fucking 30 cents. Now it's under 20 cents. Now oh, fucking out of there. Yeah, well, you could have shorted that, couldn't you, mate? Yeah, if you'd have stopped fucking moaning and gone to your laptop or your PC or even just your phone and just push back, short, short. And then, I'll get Alex at. It won't be fucking hell, it's at 20 cents again. It'd be like, boom, we went down to 20. We smashed that 20 cents region. Pulled in some profit. Oh, yes. But instead, no, your bottom... <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> yeah. It's basically the moaners. Just a little disclaimer. Usually when I say you have to... You, 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 you. I'm, I'm, I'm at the moaners. People moaning about shit. I get fucking sick of it. I get proper, proper sick of people just, just moaning for nothing. Do you know what I mean? So, it is what it is, mate. We need to make our money work for us. It, make your money work for you. Make your crypto work for you. And then, and then, do a bit of work yourself on something you love. Get out the job you eat. Stop moaning about shit you can't really control. And start executing on the stuff you can control. Guys, it's just a matter of time and I don't I don't want to see anyone left behind who shouldn't have been left behind. So dig your heels in and make your money work for you. Yeah? Live long and hoddle, baby. Always keep that little bit. Always hoddle that little bit for your future. But it's time to fucking execute now. It's time to make shit happen. Yeah? You know the script. We love crypto. We love XRP. And we love you. Enjoy your new year. Enjoy the rest of the week. And I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.